I'm Brother Coach. And I'm your host, Brother Coach. I'm here with Sister Lawyer Janet Cummings, the old, new, old, new, old, new small group minister. Welcome, Janet. Thank you for having me. Well, we're glad to have you. We had you here today to talk about point number four. Travel together. So again, when we talk about travel together, we're referring to small groups. Well, what is the official height requirement for these small groups? Small groups are not about small, it's I mean, do you make concessions for large men? Well, yes. Small groups are about small groups of people, not small people. I am personally a big fan of traveling together in small groups for safety purposes. See, if Brother Coach is traveling somewhere, he wants a small group of people around him in case of a freak bear attack. If a bear attacks, I have more people to push down on the ground and get away from the bear. I, I'm not sure you're understanding what small groups are about. Small groups are about people in church living life together. And, and now, this sounds exactly like what Brother Coach has been looking for. See, I had a, two weeks ago a freak barbecue accident at my apartment. And so I'm wondering, do you have maybe a spare bedroom that's big enough for Brother Coach and a various assortment of breakfast meats? You don't live in the same house together. That's not the way you live life together. You travel towards God together. You, you learn about how to be a better uh, Christian and how to, to have a relationship with God, but you don't live in the same house together. Yeah, it's very interesting. So I hear what you're saying, but uh, what kind of interplanetary traveling device would one have to be inside of to travel towards God? You don't travel like in a spaceship towards God. You just get closer to God in a relationship. It's not, you're not actually traveling in a spaceship. Well, Brother Coach doesn't put much value in deepening relationships and emotions and all that baloney, but I do have to wonder, if one does get into a deeper relationship with this God, what kind of present might he want for Valentine's Day? It's not really about that kind of relationship with God, um, but you would have relationships like that with the people in your small group, perhaps. Hmm. So you're saying that small groups are a good place to find some singles? No, 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 that's not what I'm saying. Obviously, these small groups are very similar to watching game film. That's where I stand up in front of a chalkboard and a video screen and I explain to the players how awful they are at everything they do in life. Brother Coach can get behind a group like that. No, 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 no. As a matter of fact, so what's your personal strategy for just tearing somebody a new one? I, I, I don't even know how to answer that. So, is it true that you have an intern here training, Joshua Ojeda? Josh Ojeda, that's right. Hmm. And why do you think they don't want you? Well, it isn't that they don't want me, but jo I'm just training Josh to be the next minister of small groups. He's my intern right now. Mm-hmm. Whatever makes you sleep at night, sister. What do you know about deep lunges? Nothing. Better short shorts. Nice socks. Thanks, they help me with squat thrusters. <laughs>